Weather Authority with meteorologist Julie Henricks. Well, good morning. A mild Tuesday for the entire Wabash Valley. Once again, today, temperatures will be well above normal. Even warmer as we get into the day tomorrow, we will be nearing record highs for the area. A drop in temperatures will come as we wrap up the week and head into the weekend. But I do think even though it will be cooler and closer to normal, it will be a nice weekend and a dry weekend too for the area. All right, let's show you what's happening this morning. On our satellite and radar combined, we did have a few clouds coming through in the overnight hours. Now this morning, as you head out the door, we are going to see temperatures today warming once again. As we get up to around that 70 degree mark this afternoon, it won't be quite as warm as yesterday because we have a little shift in the winds today behind a front that brought those clouds through, but still very mild for this time of the year. Those winds this afternoon will be lighter and they'll be more from the north versus the south. So as we go through the day into the night and into the start of tomorrow, those light winds will again not be a big factor like they were yesterday when it was quite breezy, but they'll be changing once again as we head into the overnight and into the day tomorrow. And they'll also be picking up speed tomorrow again as well. Today we start with just a few clouds out there early, but we're going to see a lot of sunshine as we go through the day. We will see the opportunity for some rain as we go into Wednesday night and Thursday morning. Now I say opportunity because it's not a lot of rain that we expect. As a cold front sweeps through the area, it will more noticeably drop temperatures for us as we head through the end of the week and into the upcoming weekend. But dry weather is expected throughout that time period. Right on into the middle of next week, we're not seeing any real rain chances. So whatever we get Wednesday night and into Thursday morning is really the only opportunity this week. And as you can see, it won't amount to a whole lot and certainly not what we could use at this point. As temperatures change though, and they will, there will be some noticeable differences there. Today's temperatures mild, just slightly cooler than yesterday. Tomorrow is going to be the warmest day this week, and I'm talking near record highs. The record is 80 degrees, and I don't think we'll be too far from that by tomorrow afternoon. Once that front sweeps through, we cool things back for the end of the week and the weekend, but that's even short-lived. I think as we hit the middle of next week, we're going to be looking at temperatures warming once again to above normal. Not just here, but much of the country will be experiencing a pattern that means warmer than it should be for mid-November. Today, a high of around that 70 degree mark, sunny skies, winds east-northeast and much lighter today. Tonight, winds shift again and we start to turn them back to the south. As we cool only into the mid-50s, we'll see a few clouds coming in as that warm front lifts through the area overnight. Tomorrow, behind it, we get to near 80 degrees, a very mild Wednesday ahead. Temperatures will then be noticeably cooler as we end the week and get into the weekend. Highs in the 50s, but that's where we should be. As you see, by early next week, we're right back into the low 60s once again. All right, thanks so much.